Now this one here is our uh, Mach 3 head rope. This rope was uh, designed for Speed Williams. He wanted small, fast, with a lot of body. And the reason for the body then was uh, just like it is now. I mean, to, it stays open as you, th as you throw it. You can use a softer rope and it'll open up on the way to the steer and then come tight real fast. And there had already been some, some smaller ones, but there's the one that uh, all of a sudden really made everybody start dropping the sizes in their ropes. I mean, uh, the uh, success Speed had with it, and it was one of the first colored ropes out, so it was, you know, real visible, so people seen, what is that? And, uh, you know, the news got out, hey, it's, these are small, light, fast ropes, and it's a, it's a huge advantage if you want to get it on that, that steer real fast. I mean, you can get it up and get it gone real quick. This one rope that I mean it seemed to it just seemed to fit like everybody. I mean it fit from the beginner all the way up to the you know the world champions. It's you know it was easy to handle, it's light, but it still had enough weight with enough tip. You know, it was just a real good universal rope all the way around. This is the rope that really helped put uh, fastback on the map. The difference between the head rope and the heel rope in the Mach 3, um, we've we've actually used different nylon. Uh, we use different nylon on all the head ropes versus what we use on the heel ropes. But uh, the head rope is smaller in, uh, in these ropes than what the Mach 3 heel rope is. And that was uh, by design because we didn't want to get the ropes too small to be, um, be hard on the cattle. Um, and uh, here's the heel rope right here. This rope here was designed along the same line as the head rope for the different purpose, you know, but, f but for healing. It's been kind of the staple of the, of the bunch too. It's easy for anybody to handle. It goes all the way from a 35 foot soft all the way up to medium hard. This is one of the ropes we built in a left-handed rope also. It's been just a great rope for, for a long time ever since we brought it out and it's still doing real well. It's just, Real easy to handle. Like if uh, you know if you're struggling maybe with uh, with another rope, just pull one of these out and get some runs on it. I mean you can really feel your tip. You can you know place your bottom real easy. It holds a dally really good. I mean, just great for especially you know them big old soggy cattle.